I'm going to show you how to hide millions of dollars from the IRS using my 112 blind trust strategy. No, I'm just kidding. Look, I get the question all the time about, hey, Tyler, can we save money and hide money from the IRS and pay zero taxes using trusts? Yes, there are some structures that allows you to tier different types of trusts, and that's a whole ball of wax, and it's a different specialty. But I just chatted with a buddy of mine who does that and asked him, so what's the break even on when it makes sense to start looking at using high level trust planning if you're in like a state like California or New York or something? And he's said, it's about a net worth of $30 million. So if you're over that $30 million net worth, DM me, I'll make. What did I tell you? So now you believe me, huh? Net worth of 30 million, but every little coach then told you guys, go get a trust and your net worth is 5,000. Your net worth is 50,000. Somebody then told you to go get a trust. So Tyler told you guys, so now I'm telling you again, after I've been telling you guys this for the past year or so, but Thank you, Tyler, I, for telling the people over here that your $50,000 for net worth trying to hide things from the IRS, you don't make enough to even fall within that bracket. So, yeah, if you got a trust and your net worth is not nowhere near even a million dollars, you're wasting your time. I've been trying to tell you guys for years, but now I have someone else to help me tell you guys.